Magandang umaga sa inyong lahat. Ako po si Carlo Rivera, representative ng TAMS International Business School. TAMS, together with PTTC, are the learning partners of DTI in this project. On behalf of the organizers, I'd like to welcome all of you to Control Plus Biz Reboot Now with this masterclass, How to Sell Your Product Online. Itong Control Plus Biz Reboot Now ay bahagi ng mga proyekto ng DTI na tutulong sa transformation ng mga micro, small, at medium enterprises sa pagnenegosyo na gamit ng e-commerce technologies. Ang programang ito ay may kasamang assistance tulad ng access sa e-commerce platforms at enablers, loans, discounts galing sa delivery platforms, at libreng training at webinars. In the spirit of Bayanihan, Our enabling partners across the entire e-commerce ecosystem will provide their expertise and experiences on how to take advantage of the digital space. Before we start our session, may I first introduce to you DTI ROG Undersecretary Blesila Lantayona, who will give the opening remarks for our speaker, Seller Education Manager for Shopee, Dre Herrera. Assisting Dre behind the scenes are Carol C, Lead for Community Acquisition for Shopee, and Janica Villia, their Acquisition Manager. They are working behind the scenes to answer your questions on the chat. So without further ado, our opening speaker, Undersecretary Blesila Lantayona. Yusek? Ako po si Yusek Bless Lantayona ng Regional Operations Group of the Department of Trade and Industry. And I am pleased to welcome you all to day two of DTI's Control Plus B's Reboot Now. Sorry. As what was mentioned Yusek, earlier. Uh, sorry, can you yes. turn on your video, please? Sorry. Oh, wala pala akong video. Wait, ha? Yusek. Oh, yes. Ah, okay, that's okay. See you now. Better. Thank you. Okay. Thank you very much. Um, as I have said, I am pleased to welcome you all to day two of DTI's Control Plus B's Reboot Now. As what was mentioned earlier, Reboot Now is an online conference organized e-commerce sector. Our record shows that over 4,000 Who registered? There were over 4,000 who registered, and yesterday, in fact, the Zoom meeting was oversubscribed. Hence, we expanded to FB Live, which was good because our negotiation centers were able to listen uh, to our resource speakers who are e-commerce practitioners. Salamat po to our learning partners, Tams International and also to our agency partner, Wonderman Thompson, for developing Control Plus B's Reboot Now brand. Our tagline says, Control Plus B's Reboot Now. The message is in fact very simple. We want our MSMEs who are now confronted with many challenges because of uh, COVID-19 to take control of their business by going online because e-commerce is the new normal. It is our government's priority to assist the MSMEs. DTI, for its part, has a package of services for the MSMEs delivered to the regions and provinces through our 16 regional offices, 81 provincial offices, and more than a thousand negotiation centers all over the country. I am sure that many of you are familiar with these services and the programs of DTI, such as free entrepreneurial and managerial trainings and seminars through our SME Roving Academy, Kapatid Mentor Me, business consultancy services, mentoring, coaching via our negotiation centers, product design and development services, and marketing via our Autop Next Gen, financing programs via our SB Corporation's P3 and regular financing programs, and many more. 
Our newest program, Reboot Package for Online MSMEs, is intended to promote e-commerce, and it consists of the following. In fact, it was mentioned earlier, but I'd like to repeat, no? Uh, this gives assistance in starting online business, either through FB, Instagram, or through onboarding marketplace platforms such as Shopee, Lazada, Zalora. And then waiving of onboarding for those who want to sell through the marketplace platforms, loans through our SB Corporation. It's ready now, this loan programs, and I think this will even be uh, the amount that will be given as loan will even be increased, no? And then also discounts on delivery platforms such as QuadX, Grab, Lalamove to help. And then of course, training such as this through webinars. I chose to be in this uh, session because uh, the topic, how to sell online is a question I often hear from our entrepreneurs. I am sure that our speaker from Shopee can really share the how-tos of selling online. Now at this point, allow me to acknowledge the Bayanihan spirit that we have today. The government, the private sector, e-commerce platforms, the MSME mentors band together, especially during this time of crisis. They are willing to help our MSMEs start their online business or even expand uh, their businesses. Finally, to all our entrepreneurs out there, listen and learn, ask questions. We are here to help you, we in DTI, are rooting for you. Take control of your business and reboot now. Have a very productive day today. Thank you very much and welcome to Reboot Now. Thank you very much, Yusek Bless. And now, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, our presentation by Seller Education Manager for Shopee, Dre Herrera. Hi, good morning, guys. Thank you, Yusek Bless, and thank you, Carlo, for introducing, for that good introduction. No? So, guys, I am Dre Herrera, and I will be speaking for um, Shopee uh, for today. So, I am a relationship and a seller education manager. Now, I will be guiding you on how um, we can um, expand yung mga businesses natin into online e-commerce, kagaya na lang ng platform na Shopee. All right. So I'll be sharing with you po ang aking screen. So um, so sana marami kayo matutunan for today. Um, and then uh, later on po after ng full discussion natin, uh, gagawin naman po natin is to actually uh, facilitate yung ating mga um, questions. Now we have also um, Carol and we also have um, Janica from our acquisition team. Um, be onboarded sa ating platform, kagaya na lang po ni Shopee. Alright? Now, um, to start off ang ating um, slide for today, so, um, ang main topic po natin is to how to sell your products online. Now, I know most of you guys have um, yung own businesses po natin, whether we are a, a micro or a, um, a small or a medium enterprises. So basically, we're focused into building ourselves, no? into building our reputation with, when it comes to having our business. Now, it's also great, lalo na for you guys, kagaya po natin, mga negosyante and such, na i-expand din natin yung capability natin to be present in our online e-commerce, kagaya na lang po ni Shopee. No? So ngayon, ang session po natin is to actually, um, how to actually be present po sa ating um, um, online platform, kagaya ni Shopee. So una po sa lahat, tatanungin po ba natin bakit Shopee? Okay, bakit si Shopee? Ano ba si Shopee? So una po, si Shopee po is the fastest growing online shopping platform sa greater Southeast Asia. Present po tayo in Taiwan, in Vietnam, in Philippines, Malaysia, Singapore, 
Indonesia. Alright, so ang ating headquarters po ay located sa Shopee, Singapore. So globally po, si Shopee meron na siyang kita or income in a quarter, uh, quarterly basis na 5.6, at least range po, 5.6 billion US dollars. Now, when it comes naman sa orders na nag-generate ni Shopee per quarter, you, we usually have a 440 million orders each quarter po. So just imagine you being present po sa ating plot form natin na si Shopee. Basically, we can contribute to that overall um, income and to that overall orders that we receive. Okay? So it's also good for you guys kasi we get to promote yung businesses natin online. Okay? We have over 10 million orders uh, or 10 million um, sellers rather po. And again, present po si Shopee sa 7 market. So if we have um, mga kamag-anak na located in Taiwan, located in Thailand, uh, Vietnam, and other um, any other countries na outside Philippines, of course, we can also encourage them na, boy, benta ka naman sa Shopee para at least kumikita ako dito locally sa Pilipinas and at the same time, kumikita ka rin international. Alright? Now, if you can also check po um, whether you're using iPhone or you're using an Android devices, you can check po sa category na shopping, number one, si Shopee, of course, okay? So, so si Shopee po ang most downloaded app when it comes to shopping um, category in these six countries, all right? Um, regardless kahit anong gamitin natin, whether it's iPhone or it's Android, of course, nangunguna pa rin si Shopee. Now, tatanungin niyo po, bakit ako kailangan magbenta sa Shopee or bakit tutulungan tayo ni Shopee. Ano yung pwedeng matulong ni Shopee pagka nag-onboard tayo on the platform? Well, advantages of selling online through Shopee po is first, mobile first. So, alam ni, alam ni Shopee na hindi lahat ng Pilipino po merong laptop. But, lahat ng Filipino definitely merong smartphone. Minsan, hindi lang isa. Diba? Minsan, meron tayong dalawa, tatlo. So, si Shopee uh, went through a deliberate decision to go straight to mobile app by passing the web. So, um, si Shopee po kasi focus siya on reaching out even to those Filipinos na kahit nasa remote areas, nasa uh, mga um, key cities natin sa provinces. So, definitely, meron silang app ng Shopee. Alright? Kaya mas nakilala po si Shopee when it comes to online selling. Number two, of course, si Shopee, social interaction ang focus natin. So si Shopee kasi is a marketplace na merong capability to actually have um, a direct contract of uh, or direct contact of buyer to seller and of course, seller to buyer. So when we say buyer to seller po and seller to buyer, you will act as a seller po. Diba? Tayo yung nagbebenta. Of course, yung mga customer natin, what we call them is buyer po. So directly, si Shopee kasi may social interaction siya. So instead na si Shopee po yung uh, magbibigay ng or mag-accommodate uh, mag ng uh, mga words natin or actual gusto nating sabihin sa ating mga buyers, you directly can speak to your buyers. Isn't that good, diba? So may magandang platform na tayo that can accommodate the, um, a good communication when it comes to our buyers. Number three, buyer experience. Kung papansin nyo po, if you have downloaded um, Shopee and sa mga hindi pa po nagda-download ng ating Shopee app, if you would download our Shopee app, buyer and seller experience. Meaning, si Shopee app po, pinadali na natin yung user interface niya. So when we say um, user interface, kung paano po natin nananavigate yung buong app itself. So mapapansin nyo, sobrang dali, madaling makita pag flash sale, pag flash sale, or madaling makita pag mga flash deal natin. Madali ring makita yung mga overall categories ng app na pwede tayong mag-browse, di ba? So ease of use not only to you guys as a sellers or potential sellers, but also dun sa mga buyers natin. So, di ba, ang gusto naman natin, lalo na Pilipino, hindi naman tayo, alam mo yun, tech savvy. Hindi tayo ganun ka tech savvy. So, mas maganda kung meron tayong specific app, di ba, na sobrang daling intindihin yung um, interface, di ba, in such way na uh, mabilis for us to do a transaction. And number four, 
is integrated logistics and payments. So, ito po ang isang advantage ni Shopee. So, instead of we guys, kunyari, gusto nating maging present on the online platform and then gagamit tayo ng other platform. So, syempre, pag gumagamit tayo ng other platform, so risky, di ba? Yung security natin, hindi natin alam kung babayaran tayo, hindi natin alam on how we can fulfill our orders, especially po, lalo na ngayon, that uh, the ECQ has been placed on, lalo na strictly in our country. So, si Shopee, po siyang integrated logistics and payment in such way na hindi na natin kailangan lumabas na high as a seller to actually provide um, orders to our potential customer or potential buyer. Kasi si Shopee, meron siyang Shopee guarantee and meron din siyang Shopee wallet. Ibig sabihin, kung matutuloy man po or ma-fulfill natin, makukomplete natin yung orders natin sa ating mga buyers or customers, definitely po, mas mabilis natin makukuha yung payment natin. Di ba, ang risky kasi when it comes to online, hindi natin alam at the end of the day kung mababayaran tayo. Na-fulfill na natin yung orders or na-provide natin yung orders, yung gusto ng market sa atin. But yet, at the end of the day, ang question natin is how do we get paid? So kay Shopee, wala ka pong problema for that. Okay? Kasi meron tayong Shopee guarantee and Shopee wallet, which also acts as a protection po for the potential sellers natin. And of course, meron tayong free shipping, sabi ko nga sa inyo, if you will become a seller po ni Shopee, di ba? hindi na natin kailangan lumabas ng bahay because definitely there will be a delivery person or a rider coming in sa, sa place po natin, will come pick up yung mga pinrepare nating orders and then sila po yung magpo-fulfill papunta sa ating mga potential buyers. So ganun po ang um, free shipping ni Shopee. So pick up, Free pickup, free delivery. Okay, ganun ka-integrated. And of course, meron tayong partner na more than 70 regional and local logistics provider built into the app. So para mag-book ng actual pickup po for Shopee, hindi na natin kailangan lumabas ng app. On the app itself, we actually book po yung ating mga orders. Alright? Now, also, um, number four. So, Next, now, si Shopee Philippines, so kanina uh, pinag-usapan natin si Shopee globally no? na available siya into seven countries. Now, pag-usapan naman natin since we are in the Philippines, of course, pag-usapan natin si Shopee Philippines. So, si Shopee Philippines is the number one online mar uh, marketplace na meron tayo. Um, and then we have more than 30 million downloads. Uh, for all users, it comes from all the buyers and sellers na meron tayo on the platform. We have more than 1,200 brands and retail partners in the Shopee Mall. We have more than 95% of orders coming in from mobile. Sabi ko nga po sa inyo, sa ang mga Pilipino laging may cellphone yan, hindi man, dalaw, hindi man isa, dalawa, tatlo. So technically po, uh, when, the, when we... Um, uh, when we accept orders coming in from our potential buyers and buyers, most likely nanggagaling po yun sa mobile. So, napi-place nila yung mga orders nila through mobile phone. So, syempre, kahit minsan, as a Pilipino, di ba, uh, gabi pa lang nagpapantok. Umaga pagkagising natin, una natin hinahawakan telepono, di ba? So, browse-browse tayo. And of course, it always gives, uh, kumbaga, a... Uh, potential uh, potential ano sa inyo eh, as potential um, sellers to actually um, conduct your business di ba into online marketplace kung papansin niyo po when you have a physical store guys di ba po minsan ang operating hours natin from um, let's say 9 a.m. to um, 8 p.m. so meaning from um, 8 p.m. onwards hanggang bago mag 9 a.m. wala tayong benta Pero pag tayo ay available sa ating mga online platform, kagaya na lang ni Shopee, di ba kahit natutulog tayo, may business tayo, may kita tayo. So that's the advantage of being an online seller, which you can also uh, discover, di ba? So also, si Shopee Philippines kasi meron tayo currently na almost or more than actually, more than 500,000 total active sellers. So just imagine, di ba, kung ano yung mga pwede pa nating mabenta. It also gives us an idea po kung ano pa ba yung mga pwede nating mabenta online. 
Now, also si Shopee, since yun nga, um, Philippines currently is placed on ECQ, lalo na ang Metro Manila and yung mga nearby provinces natin. So si Shopee, of course, we want to be able to still fulfill orders, di ba, coming in from our website. So si Shopee enables social distancing with uh, supporting economic continuity. Kagaya na lang, of course, ng DTI natin. So um, si Shopee is uh, promoting essential and supporting communities and frontliners natin when it comes to um, selling. So si Shopee, we have launched and uh, pushed also yung Shopee Mart natin, wherein yung potential buyers natin can shop safely from their own home po. So meaning, tayo as potential buyer then possibly ni Shopee, hindi na natin kailangan lumabas ng bahay, di ba? Para mag-grocery, para pumila, and para maging risk, di ba, sa sakit currently. So ngayon, si Shopee, uh, meron ta- um, continuity, uh, continuously uh, nag-ooperate yung ating platform e-commerce para makapag-provide ng mga essential goods, di ba? Lalo na sa ating mga uh, uh, potential buyers. And, and of course, meron tayong Uh, we want to give back also to our community with um, and helping frontliners. So we have um, since donated over um, 100,000 masks and 3,000 um, test kits to our frontliners in our community. And of course, we have recently launched the Shopee Bayanihan Ambagad para sa bayan. Now, this Bayanihan is a uh, wherein. Uh, we had the platform of Shopee um, help um, donations to help the fight versus um, COVID-19. Okay, so um, technically, si Shopee hindi lang siya hindi lang siya as a platform online e-commerce, de ba? Gusto rin natin makahelp sa community natin kagaya na lang niyo, right? Now, also, bakit nga ba natin kailangan uh, enroll sa Shopee or be present sa Shopee? Because una po sa lahat Si Shopee also makes it easier for you to um, pay uh, or through the uh, different payment methods na meron tayo. So si Shopee, meron po tayong shop. Meron po tayong cash on, de- cash on delivery or what we call COD. Meron din tayong credit, credit and debit cards. Meron tayong online banking. Meron tayong remittance or payment center. Meron tayong over-the-counter and bank transfer. So technically po, kung magiging present po ang business natin on the online platform, di ba, we would be able to fulfill, di ba, orders kagaya na lang ng cash on delivery. Now, what's the downside po of being in a platform, online platform e-commerce tapos hindi Shopee? So minsan, yung mga potential buyers natin, di ba, ayaw nilang nagbabayad ng ano, uh, prepaid. So meaning, ayaw nilang nagbabayad na hindi pa nila nakukuha yung actual orders nila. So, minsan, hindi lang lahat ng Pilipino, di ba, may credit or debit cards. Likely, if you'll be ordering, mas gusto mo na cash on delivery. This is what we can offer you guys. Okay? You, you will be able to fulfill yung orders po ng mga potential buyers natin or potential customers natin through cash on delivery. Di ba? Mas maganda yun. Mas marami tayong may encourage to actually purchase our products online. All right. Now, also si Shopee po, sabi ko nga sa inyo kanina at the start of our slides or presentation, na si Shopee marami tayong partner logistics, 'di ba? Or third party logistics that can be able to uh, fulfill yung orders natin papunta sa ating mga buyers or customers. So si Shopee is always ready to help you. So meron tayong mga different logistics provider, kagaya na lang ni Shopee Express, the Entrego, the Black Arrow or uh, Bay Integrated, we have Expost, we have LBC, we have Ninja Van, uh, we have JNT Express to go group and we have Zoom Courier even yung Grab Express to actually fulfill your orders. So imagine niyo po kung kayo yung ating uh, kung kayo ay present na on the Shopee platform. So again, hindi na po natin kailangan lumabas ng ating mga bahay to actually fulfill and orders and do business with Shopee. Automatically po, itong mga couriers na nakikita nyo po into your screen, sila po yung pupunta sa bahay nyo at sila rin po yung maghahatid ng orders papunta sa ating mga potential buyers. So, di ba? Sobrang convenient for us. We can actually do a business while staying at home. Di ba? Also, now, 
since na nasabi ko na po lahat ng magagandang uh, or uh, lahat ng pwede nating ma-offer to you or potential sellers. So how do you sell products ba on Shopee? Diba? So sobrang interested na tayo. Pero Dre, paano ba ako magiging present sa inyong online platform? So una po sa lahat, madali lang. Okay, kailangan mo lang magkaroon ng apat na bagay. So unang-una po sa lahat is mobile phone or at least a computer or laptop. Kung wala man po tayong computer or laptop, pwede na po yung mga mobile phones natin. Since most of you guys are um, using naman mga smartphone, so again, sobrang dali lang i-download ng ating Shopee app. Alright? Pangalawa po, internet connection. Of course, so si Shopee, it's a uh, platform e-commerce po. So meaning po, kailangan niyo talaga ng internet to actually um, browse on the Shopee platform. Number three is a bank account. So, itatanong niyo bakit, Dre, kailangan ko magkaroon ng bank account? Una po sa lahat, saan ipupunta ni Shopee yung inyong mga inyong mga kita? Siyempre, gusto namin na makuha niyo rin kagad yun since, of course, kaya nga tayo nagbe-business is to have an income, di ba? So, kailangan meron tayong bank account details na ready para doon i-credit po ni Shopee lahat ng income sa online store. At yung pinaka-importante po sa lahat is our pickup addresses. Alright? So, bakit kailangan mag magkaroon ng pickup addresses? So, sabi ko nga po kanina, ang ating mga 3PL or partner couriers po ay pupunta sa inyong mga bahay to actually pick up yung orders at yun ang i-deliver nila sa ating mga potential buyers. So, kailangan malaman din nila kung saan nila pipick up it itong mga orders na to. Okay? So, ngayon po, itong kailangan lang itong and definitely magiging present na tayo on the shopping platform. So, later on, after our slide um, presentation po, I'll be introducing you also to Carol and um, Janica. Well, um, sila po ay part ng team natin for Shopee at sila po yung makakatulong to actually um, help you be onboarded sa ating platform. At kung meron naman po tayong particular brand na pinikerry, of course, gusto natin maging um, Shopee Mall seller or uh, an official brand for Shopee. Of course, kailangan lang natin mag-submit ng mga other requirements. Of course, BIR, 2, 3, kailangan to. Importante to, okay? So, of course, I or SEC permit and huwag natin kakalimutan ang collection receipt and sales invoice. That is kung gusto natin maging official um, shop ni um, Shopee. So official shop po is definitely those um, sellers po na nagkikerry ng isang specific brands which they have a, um, uh, a form or a legal document to support that. All right? So, sobrang dali lang po again, if you want to be a seller for Shopee, ang kailangan lang natin, mobile phone. Next is internet connection. Next is a bank account details. And lastly, but most importantly, a pickup address. Alright? Now, if you have all of those requirements na, download na natin yung Shopee app nyo po. So, para ma-download ng ating Shopee app, just go to our um, Apple App Store. Or you can also get it from our Google Store if you're using an Android device. So just type in Shopee or we can go to the category of shopping. And of course, makikita natin si Shopee as the number one free app on the Shopee category. Alright? So meron po siyang orange logo and you can see the word Shopee. Alright? Next, after nyo po ma-download yung app. Okay? So set up na tayo ng account natin. So... To actually set up your account, register lang po tayo, provide a username, and provide a password. After which, we can go to the Me tab on the up, on the lower left portion or lower right corner pala. Alright? On the lower right corner, you can see the Me tab. From there, you can click po ang ating seller assistant. Once you click on the seller assistant, um, it may uh, lead you to the um, different... Um, uh, features natin na meron sa seller assistant, i-click lang po natin ang ating shop profile. So, once we click on the shop profile, pwede na po natin i-edit yung ating shop name for Shopee. Diba? Kung gusto natin na ilagay natin yung ating um, Dre Merchant, General Merchandise. Diba? So, pwede natin ilagay yon. And we can also upload yung mga logos or physical look of our physical stores. And then we can write in some of the description na meron for 
our shop. Like, uh, we started our business way back 2001, and then we focus on gantong materials, or we focus on fulfilling orders sa ganto. Alright? So, now, also, if you guys, usually sa inyo, diba, as a business owner, minsan kilala na yung business natin into our city. Kunyari, uh, we are located, kunyari, ako, personally po, I am from um, Antipolo Rizal. So, kunyari, uh, ang business ko is kilalang, kilala lang sa Antipolo. But I want to expand my business even sa Visayas region and even sa Mindanao region. Now, if you want to expand your business, being online, uh, being an online um businessman or being a uh, present sa ating mga online platform kagaya na lang ni Shopee would give you that advantage of course diba mas ma-reach natin yung mga potential buyers natin kahit na hindi sila taga Antipolo Rizal diba so so again if we can open our shop in Shopee we can um edit yung shop name natin we can upload yung mga logos natin for our shop we can write in our description for our, um store uh, make sure lang na i-register din natin yung ating mga mobile numbers and yung mga email addresses natin para di, um di ba uh, updated pa rin tayo sa mga sa mga um, push notification or notification shot in Saturday Shopee Philippines all right number 2 if we create an account na um and set up our shop name na syempre enable naman na natin yung pickup address natin so sabi ko nga po sa inyo enabling your pickup address is very crucial di ba important to para of course alam ng mga 3PL couriers natin or ating mga courier or delivery person kung saan po kukunin ang uh, mga orders na gusto natin i-fulfill. To, to actually do that, open nyo yung po ulit yung inyong mga Shopee app kung nakapag-download na po tayo ng Shopee app natin and then we go to Meetup. Again, ang Meetup po ay makikita nyo po sa lower right corner. Alright? Now, after natin i-click yung Meetup, we go to My Shop. Alright? After we go to My Shop, let's click on the gear button na makikita nyo po sa upper right corner. Okay? And then, click on My Addresses. From there po, pwede na po natin ilagay yung ating mga registered addresses. Kagaya na lang ng Antipolo Rizal, uh, di ba? Or kagaya na lang na from Quezon City, NCR, or from Pasig, NCR. Alright? So, pwede natin input yun. After natin i-input yun, of course, syempre importante that we input our bank details. So, when we input our bank details, so punta lang po tayo ulit sa ating Shopee app, to the Me tab, and then click po natin yung um, gear button sa upper right corner. Once we click on the gear button, it will let us, uh, it will lead us to yung mga my profile, my address. I-click lang po natin is yung bank accounts or cards. Now, if we click that po, um, definitely, ililid ka niya into pag-input ng ating mga bank account details. So, lagay lang natin yung bank account details. So, of course, si Shopee naman is strictly um, monitored by our uh, Bank of Central ng Pilipinas. So, definitely, magiging safe din naman din po ang inyong mga transaction uh, when it comes to the Shopee platform. Alright? Next is after natin ma-set up yung shop name po natin, after nyo ma-input yung bank account details nyo at ma-input yung addresses nyo, syempre mag-upload na tayo ng first product posting natin kay Shopee. So when we say first product posting, is definitely um, uploading po yung ating mga products na binibenta. Okay? So um, click on the upper uh, left corner into my shop and then add a new product. So from there, Tatanungin po, ba kayo, tatanungin po kayo kung saan po manggagaling yung photo ng first product nyo. Whether sa camera po ba, manggagaling po ba sa photos, or manggagaling to sa ating um, Instagram accounts. Okay, so pagka meron na tayong pictures, make sure lang na susundin natin yung mga uh, directive ng pictures natin or yung mga um, uh, criteria natin for taking pictures, such as taking a good photo. Kailangan at least maayos po yung ating mga pictures. And then we can upload a maximum of nine images per product listing na meron tayo. From then, um, if ever naman po na may mga variations, yung colors, or kunyari, available yung products mo into colors, pink, red, blue, white, and yellow, i-upload um, lang din po natin yun. And then of course, pag pagandahin naman natin yung product naming natin and yung product description natin. Alright? 
So for pro, uh, for um, yes, Carlo. So we're uh, we're beginning to run low on time, so let's move forward a little bit, if that's all right. Um, okay. Yes, so, sure. Uh, we before we continue on to the Q and A, we have a brief uh, a brief message from DTI Assistant Secretary Mary Jean Pacheco. Asik Jean. Yes. 